How I Use the Charming for Life course in my journey to live my best life, given by me, Jonathan Gardner, with my support person from Nancy Gardner. All about me, I'm a 20-year-old, uh, decision maker, self-advocate, homeschool graduate, cancer survivor who happens to have autism, a council member of Massachusetts Developmental Disability Council, an ambassador for Operation House Call, a Flutie Fellow for the Doug Flutie Jr. Foundation for Autism, a co-chair for the Massachusetts Supportive Decision Making Coalition. I like video games, pro wrestling, anime, and helping others. I have many different types of supports and supporters that help me live my best life. Charming the Life course can be used for your own life, for your family members, or in the work you do. The framework and tools will help you organize your ideas, vision, and goals, as well as problem solve, navigate, and advocate for supports. There are many ways people use Charting the Life course. Here are a few of them. People are using it to communicate their needs. People are advocating for the supports they need to accomplish their goals. Students are learning how life experiences impact their career goals. Families are exploring the services and supports they need. Parents, siblings, and family members are able to share their ideas, hopes, and fears for the future. Here are a few more ways. Case managers are using in planning meetings. Teachers are improving social skills at school, at home, and in the community. Information and referral staff are exploring the future with aging parents. Employment specialists are enhancing discovery and exploration that support career planning. Options counselors are providing anticipatory guidance and educating about life possibilities and leaders are transforming organizations. There is no wrong way to use the Charting the Life course tools to plan for your best life. There are so many. I'm going to show you the ones I use, and at the end of the presentation, there will be a link to find all the tools and information on the Charting the Life course. To begin, you can look at the life stages and determine which one fits you best. You can see all the different life stages here. Charting the life course can be used through all the different stages of your life. We have prenatal, infancy, early childhood, school age, transition, adulthood, and aging. There are so many great tools in the Charting for Life course. These tools can help anyone who is planning, problem solving, or working on a goal. You can use them to express your hopes, dreams, and vision to live your best life, as well as think about and plan for supports you will need to get there. I got to my vision by uh, my mom asking me lots of questions. The following are some questions that are used by the Charting the Life course that may help you create a vision. What are other people my age doing for work, fun, etc.? And what adaptations or accommodations are needed so I have similar life experiences? Am I learning how to create or maintain community connections and social capital? How could assistive technology, adaptations, or accommodations assist me in living the life I want? Am I learning how to access and integrate a variety of types of support? relationships, community assets, technology, in addition to any paid supports I receive? Do you have someone to talk to about your feelings, emotions, and concerns so that you don't feel alone? A few more questions. Do you feel empowered to ask questions or disagree with professionals? And are you helping me know questions to ask and how to assert my wishes, opinions to professionals and supporters? Are you helping me create a vision for my own life and have the life experiences to get me there? How are you encouraging self-determination at all ages, stages, and aspects of my life? Are you always keeping an eye to the future or the next stages of my life and helping me learn to do the same? My mom asked me some of these questions too throughout the years. 
I believe that I have a strong skills in the following areas. I believe that my weaknesses are. These are the people I believe may be able to help me the most. Here are the things that helped me perform well in school. If I had my choice, I would take the following classes. Here are the things that I most enjoy. When I first began, I began with the Integrated Support Star. Jonathan began using the Support Star at 13 years old. His vision was to help others any way he can. From there, he picked his support people and how they could help him. You can see pictured here is his first team of supporters, along with the different areas of support. I have had many visions for myself at different stages. Your vision may change and evolve. Once my vision was to be a professional wrestler. Another year, my vision was to learn to speak Japanese. When I turned 13 and began using Charming for Life, my vision was to help others any way I can. My vision is still the same today, but how I go about it has evolved. Here is one of many tools in the Charting the Life course. This is called the Trajectory Tool, which provides space to explore the things going well in your life or the things that are stopping you from reaching your good life. So if you see here, the arrow that shoots up is pointing towards a good life. And a good life for Jonathan is to help others any way he can. And if you see the arrow down below, this arrow shoots him towards things he does not want. And the thing that would stop him is if his voice was silenced. My favorite tool currently in the Charming for Life series is using the life domains, which we are going to show you in a minute. Here is a little bit about the life domains. Daily life and employment. What a person does as part of everyday life, school, employment, volunteering, communication, routines, and life skills. Community living. Where and how someone lives. Housing and living options. Community access, transportation, home adaptations, and modifications. Healthy living. Managing and accessing health care and staying well. Medical, mental health, behavior health, developmental wellness, and nutrition. Safety and security. Staying safe and secure. Emergencies, well-being, guardianship options, legal rights, and issues. Social and spirituality. Building friendships and relationships, leisure activities, personal networks, and faith community. Advocacy and engagement, building valued roles, making choices, setting goals, assuming responsibility, and driving how one's own life is lived. This was another tool I used to develop my vision. This is another tool from the frameworks in Charting the Life course. The Charting the Life course framework was created to help individuals and families of all abilities in all ages develop a vision for a good life. Think about what they need to know and do. Identify how to find or develop supports and discover what it takes to live the lives they want to live. The framework is the keystone for supporting a community of learning that champions transformational change through knowledge exchange, capacity building, and collaborative engagement. This is my most current life domain vision tool. In Jonathan's latest charting the life tool used here, he used the life domains which helped him to think about the current realities in his life while also thinking about what life experiences he may want to have, which will lead him to the good life that he wants. Here are my current team of supporters who helped me live my best life, as you can see below the text. Here's me living my best life with some more pictures from the previous one. It is helpful to have a vision for yourself before and after you turn 22. It is okay if your vision evolves and changes. If you are looking for supports which will allow you to be more creative and allow you to live your best life, then you may want to check out the Charting the Life course. 
If you want some more information about the Charting for Life course, here's the link. It is www.lifecoursetools.com.